Um, oh, you can't play them both at the same time. Yeah, we'll have to make our own chimes. Oh, damn, we had a really good recording on. Uh, John had the brainstorm tonight um, to go back, make another film of a good old-fashioned tarot card reading. Like the ones I used to give when I first started out, you know, reading tarot cards online and stuff. I mean, I used to make a little bit of money doing that. Mm hmm a little work on the side. And this uh, Seven of Pentacles is the first card that we drew tonight. Good evening, everyone. We're back. Yes. Hi, uh, Bowie and Joey. Yeah, your voice is shaking. I, it is. I My voice is shaking. Why is your voice shaking? Because I'm overwhelmed with emotion that you're doing this with me right now. And, you know, that you feel... That, the gumption to do this with me right now why not i thought this was a great idea honey if i have the energy i will do it yes i know and your energy is is picking up now don't you find well yes especially since you know aside from everyone that you know i feel my abundance is my health right now that's how i'm that's how i'm gonna read that card i, I hope everyone else out there is having a good experience with abundance right now um my uh this is the totem for my beautiful um turtle pet turtle lucy who still resides in arizona right lucy mm. i can't wait to see you again but i see her all the time and her energy is here in this very beautiful selenite turtle that i believe johnny what would what did you uh what did you get win him from for our anniversary we, every day is an anniversary honey where's your card I, everyone knows what i look like i look like that <laughs> so anyway greetings lucy and i feel like feel her energy there um next card we're just we we praise be god and mother and thank you for making this a protected by the uh, this reading protected by the light of Christ and um, the pure light spirit of the Holy Spirit, mm -hmm. the divine energy, positively only. Mm -hmm. And what do you know? It's the emperor, and that's Father God and Mother God themselves. Whenever I get the emperor or the empress, it's both of them. Yes, exactly. That's the way we should all be thinking, right? Forward thinking. One small here's my catchphrase if you want to move the turtle that's fine all right uh if god is if if god is on your side no one can be against you you must let god be on your side you must lena start she's been having these random really upsetting thoughts but it's just has to do with flashbacks and still grappling with stuff stuff just stuff you know as long as you're on the earth you grapple with stuff and that's the sad truth and that's next card please let's not get bogged okay i'm doing good johnny i'm feeling fine thank you oh my god this one again the seven of wands that's that was john malkovich's card yesterday we had oh we have yeah we had him in a couple of days mm -hmm wonderful uh the wonderful john malkovich and the seven of wands is is protecting the fort whether it be protecting your reputation or protecting your health or protect i, I see it as just all around protection and um you know taking that stand yeah does that make sense it it, it does yes You have nothing to fear, Lena. What are you getting paranoid about? Because I don't, I feel paranoid today. Andy, so Bridget Berlin, does she want to take a card? Yes. Hey, Bridge. Mm. Hit by a car, you poor thing. Mm. King of Pentacles. She's saying that that's how she feels about Andy. Yeah. We were really, really soulmates, heavy, heavy soulmates, right, Andy? Yeah, yeah. No, but there was nobody like Bridget in my life. Nobody. Yeah, right. You guys, yeah. I can't wait. So anyway, uh, the, and this uh, this card is a reminder that Bridget Berlin. We will be posting free access to the documentary about her life. It looks like it's going to be very good. We're going to watch that this evening. 
after a day of reading the Warhol Diaries. I tell you, show, we'll show the, the book. The book is over there somewhere. That's the book. It looks like a dictionary. That's the book. You're doing great, Lena. Thanks. Um, this card's for you, Johnny. And it's perfect because it's the sun. Mm -hmm. And we just pulled that in the last uh, video with a guest. I'm sorry. With, which one of you pulled the sun? Oh, uh, Malcolm X is the sun. Yes, that's correct. Mm -hmm. Another son of God. Yeah, you have an army of the sons of God. An army of the sons of God. And just think how much you love all of us. That's a lot of love, Lena. But there's nothing bad going on here. We know you've been scarred. We have all were scarred down there. And we can see it now from out here. What you... You, you're just figuring out how not to be afraid. And it's entirely allowed. Thank you, Andy. Johnny, you always do like a therapeutic video for me when, when you think I need it, don't you? I really do. I'm getting better at it. Yeah? Yeah. Sharing the time. Because it's worth it. Because I learned from it, too. Yes, it is worth it because you learn from it too. Is that an insult of some weird kind? About that I'm not that important, but you are? <laughs> Do you people see why I love this? Shut up. Do you see why I love her? She's got me wrapped around. All right. This is me, 10 tons of bricks in my pants walking around. You love just saying that. With that. Every time we look at this card, we haven't looked at this card in a year. Yeah, but when every time we pulled it in the pants, yeah. 10 tons of bricks in my pants. <laughs> You're giving me 20 tons of bricks in my pants right now. Cut the crap, John, and stop doing that to my back. <laughs> oh. <laughs> He's just proving to you how much control he really does have, and he does. He's very powerful. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, John. Yeah. I won't hurt you. Yeah, thanks. I do appreciate it. All right, so what do you think? Another uh, card or two? Sure. Don't get mad at me. I'm not. Why would I? Why would you think I'm mad at you? Because sometimes I just can't see. No, this card is the justice card. That's isn't that your card? No, I, I believe mine is the judgment. All right, is that right? I don't know. I think so. Well, either way, what does this mean? I don't know. Justice? Can we have a clarifier? All right. No, get it from underneath the deck. By where your, by where your legs are. Shush, 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 shush. Five of Swords. Oh, I thought about this card. Yeah, it came to you in a vision, right? Yeah. Five of Swords is thinking that you're the victor, but you really want to bow things in a in a really bad way. Mm -hmm. So how? So that combined with with those. Those types of individuals are really feeling the karma right now. If they pulled stunts and, you know, you can lie to yourself, but you can't lie to to God or the powers that be for just so long. That's why people in the mafia don't, you know, those are not good decisions. Right. Right. Good example. Yeah. Those are not good. And so those kind of people, well... Depends on it. Every circumstance is different, and that's where the justice comes in. Pull another card, why don't you? All right. I like this reading. It's it's interesting. We haven't had a reading like I know, and that's why you and that's what we do very well. Yeah. Andy, would you like this one? Yeah. Um. So you said that uh, uh, earlier. You uh, alluded to the fact that. Um, my excess could be forgiven because granted by, because of my charm. Was I correct in interpreting it that as yes, no, not really your charm. I don't know how charming you really were. 
I know that you are an amazing relayer of information of how you how it filtered through your psyche and a, and you have a great way of expressing yourself a magnificent way of expressing yourself that is so interesting i'm not kidding mm. and so these diaries are are precious and they're they're incredible uh, it's an incredible you hear your voice it's you know and it's uh, there's and and i like what i hear but but some of the excess did seem whatever but then again you know i don't know what i would have been like at that time if i had access to that kind of thing too you start to feel pretty i guess privileged i don't know was it a feeling of privilege well apps uh andy warhol was that a feeling of great privilege what the life you lived as andy warhol uh without without a doubt without a doubt and it's exactly what what was part of what I set out to do, you know, and as far as what I set out to do, I set out to do one thing one day and then the next thing I'll set, set out another day and do something completely. And I didn't know I was going to do, you know what I'm saying? Right. So to say he set out to do that, it just like everything was always what was happening in the, in the moment it had to be. Doesn't it have to be? Yes, it does. So your sense of existentialism was like surpassed like many, you know, they, they, I, I think they, they have uh, misunderstood your aloofness or at times for snobbery, but I don't think it was ever that, or was it? Oh, I could be a terrible snob, but, um, well, uh, I'll let you be the judge because I think you're more complimentary to me than I deserve to to be complimented. And that's all I was going to say to you before is that I, uh, I would have, um, you know, if I knew that I had to go back and look at my behavior, I don't know. I don't, I wouldn't everybody maybe censor themselves a little bit. Would they? I don't know. It's a good question. Or is that immediate gratification just more important than anything? Yeah. And they don't care. I mean, you know, if we, this compulsory thing to have, get, I don't know. Feels wrong. Well, the fact that you have f forgivings, uh, mi you know, misgivings about it and foreboding feelings about it means that it's something that, you know, you probably... Well, you would have to be in it to know what your reaction to it would be, I suppose. I see you doing all right. But at the same time, I see you as so sensitive that it's it's painful. Mm -hmm. Thanks, Andy. <laughs> it's quite beautiful. Oh, that's nice. Mm. What's the matter, Lena? People are being nice. What do I feel? I don't know what I feel like. Come on, Lean. You come on, Jean. Hey, Jackie. Jacko. Wheel of Fortune. Well, Michael Jackson just popped in. Mm -hmm. Hi, Mike. Hey. Ease on down the road. Yeah, all right. Just ease on down that road, girl. Mm hmm. Don't you care in nothing than my B A L O? Wait, I would, I would, yeah. Don't you care in nothing than my B A L O? Come on, eat on down, eat on down the road. Right, something like that. Mm. They look kind. Of, there's the night easing on down the road. These cards have that type of. All right, Michael. So everyone's again telling me to lighten up. Yeah, because your mind goes to very, very dark places. And it's, it's all part of the energy shift and we just got to snap you out of it because you're so beautiful when you're happy. And I'm so disgusting when I'm upset. No, <laughs> you're more beautiful, but I have to give up that for, for settle for the second most beautiful. <laughs> I, I, if I, so if I wanted to be my best self with you, <laughs> aesthetically speaking, I would be a basket case all the time. 
there there is a look about you like some kind of wild animal all right a beautiful wild animal oh. better take another card girl yeah death you're trying to kill me you're just trying to kill me john i don't even know what to th say to you anymore mm. Just keep it up, Lena. Mm -hmm. Just keep it up. Mm. And no, don't you worry about ugh, anything. Mm -hmm. Nothing. Accept good fortune. That would be my message with that. That is good, yeah. Accept good fortune. Or die. Mm -hmm. All right. Die trying. I love it. Can you say that again? Accept misfor accept good fortune or at least die trying. Thank you, Andy Warhol. I like that. What was the other thing, John, I wanted to write down? Oh, John's writing a new poem. Don't I'm not gonna say yeah. I'm not gonna say the title of it because it's so witty. But I know you're really you're really storing up for that poem. Like you that's gonna be like an unbelievable, clever forte for you. Just the title. Wouldn't you say so? John, I love you. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, do I love you? All right. This is fun, isn't it? Yeah, it's pretty fun. Swinging from this pole like that. <laughs> yeah, John, it's great. I'm really having problems. Would you help me? All right. Yeah, uh, let's just go hang out. The Hanged Man. You did a great job. We'll get. We'll play some flute tonight. One more. Why not? Cause it doesn't cost anything. Ah, oh, the kids. They miss you. You're a mess. Hi, Keith Moon is here. Yeah, the kids are not all right. You know. All right, they're all right. Ah, huh? is that you, Keith Moon? It does look like you a little. Yeah. The kids miss you, but uh, they know you love them, right? Yes, we love you, kids. I. Really, we really love you a lot. And I think it just becomes painful. Hi, Mom and Dad. Mm. This is where, see, this is the part of the video that I feel is private. <laughs> because, I, you, well, then why do you always feel compelled to, to, uh, because you hear them, right? Yes, I do. And you know you're not insane? Yes, I know. Say it again. You say it. <laughs> I'm tired. <laughs> Am I right to feel this way? Of course you are, darling. Sing a quick little ditty for me. Which one do you want? Hi, Lou. No, none of the trouble ones. Mm. A little bit of the Matthew sweet. We're the same. Mm. Baby, we're the same as we look in each other's eyes. Baby, baby, we're the same. You know what? We have, we got to get it. They have to have that on karaoke. They'll have it. Yeah. We got to do that one. We totally do. Not now, but later. All right. We'll start practicing. Remember that. We have it on film, right? All right. Well, I hope everybody enjoyed um, this evening's uh, tarot card reading. If anybody's viewing this and if it resonates with you, good. Jolly good show. I'm going to pick one more card for the universal consciousness because that's just how I roll. Again, this this reading has looked back. It's been all pentacles, other stuff too, but heavy on the, on the money. We just gave like 20 bucks today to the rescue over in Turkey where these animals are being found in the rubble. Um, you know, uh, 20 bucks, you know, I mean, that's really, I, I feels like it should be so much more, but if everyone gave 20 bucks, it would be like fucking a lot of 20 bucks. <laughs> Give to something like that today. You don't have to do it every day. Do it today though. If you would have bought yourself a sweater, if you were shop, if you were walking around with a girlfriend, if you would have bought yourself a sweater or, or anything for 20 bucks. 
but you didn't do that today, but you're the type of person that would do that all the time. Take that 20 bucks and give it to a fucking charity. Do it! <laughs> oh, John. Yeah. All right. See you later. <laughs> I love you. I love you too.